be examining the company that transports its students. Marsha Bonhart is asking if other schools using this same bus company have had any issues. Well, here is what we know so far. After three bus accidents with the first student transportation company, Vandalia Butler Schools will firmly scrutinize the busing contract. Just last week in Vandalia, a Demet Elementary student and two bus drivers were taken to local hospitals after two buses bumped. That was the third minor accident involving first student transportation and Vandalia students this school year. You, you trust your, your child's school to have their best um, interest in heart, and it's when you're hearing all these horror stories from other parents about all these things that are happening and all these accidents. Alicia Chambers' son is a first grader in the Vandalia Butler School District. She and other parents gathered at the school board meeting Monday night to iron out what they consider problems with transportation. But in Germantown, first student is in its second year with Valley View Schools. The superintendent there says transportation has been smooth because the drivers are former school district employees. They hired each of the drivers that Valley View had employed prior to first student taking over. So that made the transition so much easier. Do you think that makes a difference to, uh, I to think it makes I think it makes a, a huge difference because your people are still vested in the community, still care about your kids. It's not just a job to them. Now, I also checked with Jefferson Township Superintendent Dr. Richard Gates. He says initially there were some mix-ups with first students, but he says that with anything new, you can't expect perfection, but all has been worked out, and at this point, there are no problems. However, Vandalia Butler is still trying to work out what will happen with its contract with first student. No response today from the bus company. Marsha Bonhart, 2 News, working for you.